34-32, what an amazing four set for Macomb to pull out the victory. Well, the study in contrast in the second D4 Volleyball State semifinals, Fort Loramie is making their first ever appearance in the Final Four, while their opponents, Cleveland Villa Angela St. Joseph, is making their sixth. Vikings have a pair of state titles, were twice runners-up, including last season. Second semifinal from the Nutter Center, Loramie Army coming out to support their team. Ashley Plyman nails the kill, block rolls along the tape, and lands on the floor for Lormy. More from Fort Lormy. Hallie Bonanza backs it to Jerrica Holthaus. Fort takes set number one, 25-17. Second set now, Bonanza to Plyman off the block and finds the point, point for the, the floor for the point. And then Bonanza able to bump the Plyman. Another kill, senior 10 kills on the match. But the Vikings leading 12-8. Janelle Hoying bumping to Kaylee Barhorse. Strong swing from the sophomore. And then Kelly Turner takes over. First, the tip that finds the floor for Lormy. And then Bonanza with the pass to Turner. And Turner finds the back corner. Tied at 21 now in the second set. Bonanza finds Turner again. Another kill. Turner, 17 kills in the match. Second set point now. Turner catches the line. And Lormy takes that second set, 25-23. Up two sets to none in the third. And it's more of the same for Fort Lormy. Bonanza to Turner. Another kill for Lormy. And then Plyman. Tall at the net. A little blockeroni and cheese. And match point now. Bonanza sets to Plyman. Big swing. And Fort Lormy cruises to the straight sets victory. 25-17, 23-18. They will play for the state title in Division Four against Macomb. Seems to be some magic with a special group for Coach John Rogers. This, this team has all the puzzle pieces. Uh, and in the past, we've had maybe a tiny little bit missing here or there. We tried to hide it. We tried to cover it up. This team, there's no secrets. There's no hiding anything. Everybody, you know, we have eight seniors. And I'm telling you right now, all eight of them can play. And in the regional final game, the regional semi game, we just had a sense of urgency within us because we're seniors and we don't get to go, we don't get to put an army uniform on again. So it's just, it's almost like we're living in a fantasy right now for me. That's what it feels like. It's almost like an icebreaker for the volleyball program because it's the first time ever in our history, and it's kind of like we're setting the standards now, and this is how we want to go from here. Everyone like trusts each other on the floor. Like I trust my hitters to put the ball away. I trust my passers to. To get me the ball, my hitters trust me, and I know it doesn't sound like a lot, but on the floor, that is a key in winning a game. 